Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you stopped by today. Today's video is going to be a rainy day, relaxing style, clean with me. It is currently pouring the rain outside and I thought since I'm stuck indoors, what better way to make use of the time than to get some housework done. So that is what I will be doing today. I have some dirty floors to mop, some clothes to fold and dishes to put away. So if you're in need of some cleaning motivation, I hope that you will stay tuned. Also, I want to share with you guys this gorgeous Mark Bale watch and bangle set from a company called The Peach Box. Look at this watch, it is so pretty. This is their white marble. Um, they recently launched a new collection called the marble collection and it consists of a white marble watch face or a black white marble marble watch face. Both are gorgeous pieces and I chose the white marble because I'm a huge fan of white marble um, but it came with this white leather strap and it also came with a mesh rose gold colored strap that I can interchange for more of a dressy look but this is not sponsored they just sent me the watch in return for my review. I actually received a watch and bangle from them last month if you recall and I absolutely love them so when they contacted me again I could not refuse because I get compliments on that watch and bangle set every time I wear it so definitely go check them out. I will leave a link to their website in the description box below. Even better they gave me a discount code to share with all of you for 15% off your purchase use the code Kathleen definitely go check them out thankfully the rain didn't last too long but I am ready for some sunshine I'm curious do any of you enjoy watching thunderstorms as much as I do for some reason I find them so relaxing I will start my cleaning by conquering these dishes first, but I find it funny that whenever I clean, I always clean my kitchen first. That is the first room in my house I clean. I'm not sure why that is. It's probably because it's typically the messiest, but let me know which room in your house is the very first room that you take on. always rinse my dishes so thoroughly before putting them in the dishwasher. I swear they're already pretty much clean by the time I put them in that dishwasher. I just hate seeing any caked on food. Is anyone else like that? Do you completely clean your dishes before you put them in that dishwasher? Or do you prefer to hand wash your dishes? Let me know in the comments below.
I've talked about this before, how I use this cabinet for any important papers and reminders for the kids' school activities. So I always like to just go through it and weed out any past events that no longer that I no longer need to be reminded of because sometimes this cupboard can just get completely carried away with reminders. the door went on my knees but then to make it harder you change your voice i let you in now we are going under still with one touch you got me where you want me in it's like a rush the waves that crash inside we are To keep it nice and clean, not freak out and cause a scene. I try to hold it together. Every now and then, I like to spray a little bit of bleach down the drains of my um, sinks. This just helps to eliminate any stinky odors. Let me know what methods you guys use to eliminate odors. Down, but I'm so getting tired. Now, won't you meet? using these chargers not only does it make my table look decorated and set but also when the kids are eating at the table they can just put their plates right on top of these chargers and it catches any spills
Does anyone else get so annoyed by the vacuum cord? I'm seriously considering investing in a cordless vacuum. If any of you have a cordless vacuum that you would recommend, let me know in the comments below. If it looks like I mopped this side of my kitchen really fast, it's because my memory card got full and I didn't know it. Gotta love when that happens. Do you know what love means? This is insane. You're saying things I can't explain. I know where your heart is, where you want to be. So why do you keep testing me? It just isn't worth my time to try to make you believe. Talking in riddles, just let it go. And trust me if you love me so. It just isn't worth my time to try to make you believe me when you don't believe me. This is where I draw the line and pretend that I'm leaving. This is me leaving, I'll let you win.
example here as to why vacuum cords are so annoying. Look at that tangled mess. I was wondering why it was so hard to vacuum the far side of the room. Now I know. Speed away from the holy mind, pride. That's why I never thought it would matter. If I'm gone by now, all my weakness keep on linger, linger on. On repeat, like it will be my favorite song. Oh, I know I should be moving, moving on. But you got me good, you got me good. I keep on trying. Last chore of the day, folding this basket of clothes. Now, you can probably tell by the expression on my face that folding clothes is not my favorite chore. No, but in all seriousness, I find that folding clothes is kind of thought prov provoking. I don't know if that's the word for it. Maybe it's a little bit relaxing as much as I don't like doing it. I just find that I tend to process um, what's going on for the day, what, you know, I get deep in thought and I start thinking about what I want to do later on today and what I need to do tomorrow. I don't know, can anyone else relate to that or am I making absolutely no sense? That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, especially if you are watching up until this point. You are a superstar. Thank you so, so much to each and every one of you. You have no idea how much your support and your comments, you are all so loving and kind. I just, I really do appreciate it and I can't say that enough. So on that note, have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.